All right, T-Bay Nation, we're at the Petrov's home in sunny Tampa, Florida, and I'm with Sonia Petrov here, and we're going to show you how to utilize your pool at home with some basic essential stuff that you can either order online, you probably have in your garage, or pick it up at Home Depot or whatever. So today we're going to show you how to utilize this pool. All right, guys, so uh, we took out some stuff for you to see what kind of rope that you guys can use if you have any kind of rope. So these are the kind of ropes that you guys, basically anything. Um, so we got some thin, some thicker, okay, shorter. You need about probably like six to eight feet of rope if you have to. We're actually gonna use this rope today because it has this already kind of done on it and it's about the, this, the length that we want. Something also that, um, I can try to show you later is if you have a bungee cord um, especially with a belt so if you look if this comes with a belt I can send the link online also there's Ivan um, and uh, you can order this online and use it I'll show you another way to be able to do it um, also if you have like another belt with a buckle on it you can tie a rope on the end of it uh, but this is the basic belt that we have at the club it's about two bucks online you can order on Amazon I'll send it uh, to you guys very easy to put on this is what Sonia is gonna be using for a belt um, and yeah we'll show you in two seconds all right Bay nation so if you guys have like a pole that's near your pool where you can tie it onto and you're gonna be able to swim out like I'll show you in a second so a pole or you guys can if you have a palm tree or a tree that you can anchor it to anything that you can anchor it to come on over here Sonia okay um, but we're gonna I'm gonna show you one way which I recommend because it's going to be at a really good level um, is using the gutter actually so what we're going to do uh, the rope is already kind of like this tied so we're going to take off this part okay you guys are going to run it through the gutter up and around bring it through okay so we can go out straight so the water it's going to be pretty much almost at the water level if you really want to make it at the water level, you can, okay? A lot of different ways that you can do this. I'm just showing you uh, this way, okay? So this is not going anywhere. And then what you can do, come on over, Sonia. Let's take it. We're gonna tie it to the back of her belt. Okay. Okay. So right now, right now she is tied in with her belt that she has. I'll send you the link. Um, also, it's anchored to the gutter, which is not going anywhere. Um, it's also at a good level. You want to try maybe keep it water level. You don't want to be coming in from way up high. You want to keep it as low as you can because it's going to affect the body position, which is something we'll talk about in another uh, video. Hopefully tomorrow, Sonia and I will be able to get together and do it. So uh, yeah, now we're going to show you the swimming part. All right, T-Bay Nation, we're with Sonia here. We're all tied up, we've got the rope, um, it's tied in uh, to her belt. So we're gonna head out there, we're gonna show you what we, what we actually did is, if you have anything that sinks at all, we have two cones, luckily, but if you have like a hockey puck, a rock, anything that sinks is something to promote a straight line. So we have a cone over there, we have a cone in the water, where Sonia, that's where Sonia's gonna be. Okay, so it's a straight line from where I'm at right now. That's what you want to focus on. You don't want to be all over the place. Okay, so Sonia's going to get ready here. Let me eat the rope. So we put this cone right here in the water because that's going to be pretty much the distance so she doesn't go out and get a really good pull so she knows where it's at. Um, she's also going to use a pull boy. She has her pull boy. So if you guys have your pull boys at home, um, use it. It's going to help with your body position a lot. Uh, we just noticed when we were kind of trying this out, her hips were kind of low, and we want our hips a little bit higher. Okay, so we're gonna use the pull boy. Again, she's got one, uh, she put it, it's gonna work on her body position. So, um, we're gonna get started here. So, the cone that she has in the water, that's where she's gonna be swimming over, so she follows a straight line. If she needs to look up, she knows where she's uh, straight line is. And this is gonna be it, go for it. So if you guys are at home, it's really easy to do. You know, you, we kind of talked about it, we went through everything. So she's just working on her technique right now. Um, nice body line, 
catch that little bit of kick. Obviously, it's not ideal, but if you guys have a backyard pool and you want to have the option, this is an option for you guys. Okay? So, hope you guys can try it. If you have any videos, send it to Coach Jason. Uh, we'd love to be able to share it with you guys. All right? Good luck.